In this problem, we're told the acceleration of a particle moving along the x-axis is given by a of t is equal to the natural log of 3 to the power of t plus 2. So we're given here acceleration as a function of time. And we're told that at time t equals 2, the velocity is 2. And then we're asked, what is the velocity at time t equals 3? So we're given a function for the acceleration, and we're asked about the velocity. So you need to remember the relationship between velocity and acceleration. And the acceleration is the derivative of the velocity, which means that the velocity will be the integral of the acceleration. And specifically, from 2 to 3, if we integrate from 2 to 3, a of t dt, that will give us the change in velocity over that time interval from 2 to 3. So all we need to do here is integrate from 2 to 3 this function, the natural log of 3 to the power of t plus 2 dt, and then that will be the change in v from 2 to 3. So just add that to the velocity at 2, which we know is 2, and the result will be the velocity at 3, which is what we're looking for. So we'll do this on the calculator. So I've got numerical integration of the natural log of 3 to the x plus 2, comma, so x goes from 2 to 3, and hit enter, and it calculates 2.872. So my answer is going to be, I just add 2 to that, and 4.872 is the final answer.